All right. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. It's your boy, Trap King. And what a beautiful day we have today. And um, let us see what the market has to offer. Let's see what the market has to offer. First things first, let's quickly go and take a look at the, what's it called? Uh, one second, let me share my screen. I thought I already done that. You mean, guys, guess what? I'd have just been talking and I wouldn't have known that I didn't share my screen. Like, like seriously, I thought I shared it. There you go. You guys can see my screen. Can you guys see my screen? Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, perfect, perfect. I got you, I got you. Let's go, let's, let's start with gold. Straight from Zoom yesterday. Straight from Zoom yesterday. I cannot make it up. Look at it there, it's just in front of you there. <laughs> It's just in front of you there, guys. Check it out. It's just, look at this beauty. It's just in front of you. Where was the setup? What's this? Come on, get out of here. It's just in front of you there. I cannot make this stuff up. All right, look at it there. This was where the market was when we called it, right here. This was where the market was when we called it, right here in this candle here. That candle right there, right there on that one. You remember? Does anybody remember this? <laughs> Does anybody remember this? Is there, you guys, anybody remember this? Yeah, that's it, that's it. That was it right there. That was it right there, right here. Okay, and I told everybody, this is what I told you guys. I told you guys how we're going to trade this. I told you guys how we're going to trade this. I hope somebody listened to me, right? I said, the first target is going to be from here where we were, down to here. As a matter of fact, the market had given 40 pips. I told you guys, start managing your trade at that point, right? And then the market came all the way back up. And if you have been trading traps with me, you understand what I tell you guys. That as far as the trap has not reached TP1, that trap is still very much valid. As a matter of fact, this was a large trap. So meaning that as the market got to 40 pips and you move some stocks to break even, I took some money off the table. You should have also taken a penny in order and put here. I also, I do that. I tell that to people in no risk. All right. If you have been listening, you know I've been saying that. Okay. And then there you had it. And then look at what happens next. The market now went all the way here. To your first target of 65 pips, to your second target of 99 pips, 100 pips, as a matter of fact. And as the 100 pips, I told you guys what I was going to do. I told you guys to look here. I told you guys to look here. So your third target was going to be down here. So, in other words, Ladies and gentlemen, you should already be 100 pips up. If you didn't secure the trade, then I'm sorry about that. It's, that's not on me. All right? And then now, I told you guys, 275. Here, yeah, that's the next target. And ultimately, I told you guys that the market gets to 428. I am done. I am done. My eyes, everything I see on gold is pointing to the downside. Right? So, I'm going to take it with this. Oh, no, I'm just going to leave this here for teaching purposes because I'm still going to talk about it on team tonight. So having done that, let's look at another pair that I'm, I have my eyes on. GBP, JPY. GBP, JPY is another one I have my eyes on. I call this trade also. I don't know if anybody took it with me, but this is where we are. So this is where we are on GBP, JPY. One second, let me secure 
let me secure a part. Let me secure that goal. Let me put my stops to break even. On oh, gold, where are you go? Go, baby, come to daddy. Okay. 1795.35 was my entry. So Seventeen ninety-five points. Let me use three zero now, because I'm not giving the market a cobble. All right, good. So, all right. So that's that. So official, I have secured. I've secured the bag there. Given now, guess what? I took money off the table at forty pips. I took money off the table at sixty pips. I took money off the table at a hundred pips. Now, I'm holding on for 200, that's on gold. If that happens, I'm not touching this market. If that happens, I'm not gonna to touch this market. I'm not gonna to touch this market again. So this is where we have on, um, what's it called, on this baby here, on um, GJ. Where's our first target gonna be? Our first target is gonna be, oh man, I hate this. I hate when you do this. Come on, man, don't do that. I hate when you do that to me. So our first target is going to be our first target is going to be because we enter from here. Our first target is going to be all the way up here at 54 pips and ultimately One second. All right, so and ultimately 81 pips, right? So so I want to see this happen. So I want I want to see this happen. So that's that on what's it called? On GJ. Please, like I always preach, practice proper risk management. All right, so that if the market hurts you, um, you 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 can live to fight another day, please. Okay, very important. All right, practice proper risk management. So uh, let's take a look at USD CAD. Let's take a look at USD CAD quickly. All right, good. Now, yesterday on USD CAD, we've been talking, I was talking about this area here. How come you all enter Zooms and you guys don't mute yourself out? Like, who, who does that? Okay, so this was it here, right here. This was it right here, this one here. I was looking at this area here, and I said I was going to watch price action. So let's do this. Let's assume that you even took this trade here, based off of that trap there. Let's assume you even said, okay, let me even risk it, right? Look at this. The market came, picked you up. And where did you get to? 22 pips, your first target. Obviously, your stock should be at break even. So that's the drill. All right. But what we're looking at is uh, what we're looking at. I can't really call a trade setup on. I can't really call a trade setup on this baby because this market has already moved. What I was actually looking at was this. I was looking at this one here. I can't, I can't really call a trade on this that's moved. So. That's what I was looking at. That's what I was looking at. This this is like the most annoying thing that can happen when you're trading. When the market comes and misses you by spread, it can be very frustrating. Look at this. Misses you by spread. I can't even I can't call this trade anymore. So I mean, I can't call it anymore. So I'm just gonna let it go. So I'm just going to wait for it to completely play out. Then I'll look for the next one to come up. All right, now let's go to ERUSD. Here you are, baby. Let's go, go, go. Trap King and this B-L-D. Let us go, let us go, let us go.
So, I like what I see here. I like what I see. Here. So, uh, let's do this first. Let's All right, so I'm just gonna do this. Uh, horizontal, I'm gonna do this. Yeah, I'm gonna do this also. Here. Yeah. All right, good, I'm just gonna keep it like that that way. All right, so let me, let me get rid of this and go off and trap fibs. I think go for traps, get out of the way. So let's go to one hour H1. All right, perfect. I don't know how many of you can see what I'm doing. Call me crazy, I don't care. Ooh, ooh, oh. Can you believe that? Can you believe what's about to happen? I marked that up on the four hour time frame. And just look at this. So, another one. Yeah, I think today's um, interest rates news and um, I think FOMC. I think that's today, if I'm not mistaken, guys. Uh, trust me. I mean, I, I really, I hate to check. I don't know why I don't check the news. But in a week like this, I will check the news. I don't want any drama in my life, you know. So, so here, your first target is going to be 21, they're about, about 21 pips, 20, 21 pips. And then your final target is going to be 32 pips. So I want to also see this happen. I want to also see this happen. The truth is, guys, this, this is traps. I've gotten so good at traps because, I mean, I own this baby here. Yeah. All right, that I could take 10 traps and win 10. And guess what? I could... Take 10 and win nine. I could take 10 and win eight. I could take 10 and win seven. I could take 10 and win six. It's rare if I take 10 and win five. Very rare. It's rare if I take 10 and win six. It's rare. So I win 10, take 10 and win seven. So now, here's where you guys miss it. The mistake you guys make. The mistake you guys make is. Can you guys hear me? Your volume dropped for a second. Sorry, sorry, sorry about that. All right. So those ones that you guys are lose, those ones that you guys lose, like you guys take the normal ones that you're risking 2%, 3% and you win. And then you're like, man, this, this dude is on a roll. And then I call one trade. And then the next thing, you guys go all out. You risk 10% of your account, 15%. I like, man, I mean, track record shows he's been winning, man. Wait, he's going to win again. What if that one is the one you lose? What if that's the losing trade? And then guess what? It takes away all your profits. And you're like, oh man. And you're beating yourself up. And you're like, and maybe you miss all the trades that I've been given. And that's the only one you took. And you're like, man, this guy, this guy doesn't have a trade. It is, you need to understand that you are not going to win every trade. You need to understand that past profits do not guarantee future results. And you also, most importantly, need to understand that Proper risk management is going to save you at the end of the day. So for now, the only trade setup I have on my plate, I have gold on one account that I'm hoping to take. Okay, I have, let's start from here. I have this one now, right now, I've just called this one. So I have this trade setup here. This, you can take a screenshot, right? And you can post it in a group if you choose to. All right, so I have this one here. Then I have, uh, what's it called? I have, um, wait, hold on. Let me even post it myself. Because I could say post it in a group and nobody could post it. Somebody may, somebody may not listen to me. I'm like, oh man, dropping, I missed the train. I don't want any drama in my life. All right, so. Wait, wait, wait hold on. What did I just do? This is what I just did. I just posted the Zoom link again. 
What's wrong with you, man? What's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? The people are looking for a setup and you are busy posting the Zoom link again. What is wrong with you? So there you have it. That is a, uh, what's it called? That is um, a potential on EURUSD. One second, let me put it in our group. EURUSD. EURUSD cell potential. No, sorry. Yeah, yeah okay, the cell potential. So EURUSD cell potential, that's EURUSD. Please, ladies and gentlemen, the one I'm going to play this EURUS is if this market doesn't activate before the interest rate or before what's it called? Um, uh, before uh, FOMC, I'll delete my pending order and I'm just going to be watching. I'll stay on the sidelines. Maybe I'll reduce my lot, but I'll be very, very cautious with this. All right. So that is EURUSD. Then I talked about GJ, which I'm not going to post again because I already posted it. I talked about GJ. I'm not going to talk about. I'm not going to. I'm not going to post it because I talked about it. I'm already giving you guys GJ. Let's see. That was GJ there. That was GJ. And then finally, I talked about gold. Gold that I talked about. Nothing new. Just same old, same old. Same old thing I talked about yesterday. Same old, same old. Well, actually, in this trade setup, you can see. God, this shit is amazing. You can see for those of us still joining us, this was a candle that got activated. This was a candle. The market was here on this candle here, right here. This one here, this candle. That was where we took our trade. It was at that candle I drew this stuff. The market was actually, I think, it one, about two, three pips above this area here. So that was it there. And then we took that trade, and then we have, um, what's it called? We have, we took 40 pips off the table initially. And then again, I told everybody, I said, you know what to do. And then guess what happens? The market gives us 68 thereabout. And then the market gave us 100 plus. And now we're saying if we could go to 270. And then ultimately, the move is we're looking for 429 pips. That's what we're looking for. Are we going to get it? I don't know. All right. So, but my stops are break even. I mean, will you see 100 pips and not move your stops to break even? Somebody. Is there anybody here that will see 100 pips and will not take some money off the table? Huh? Anybody? Because I will take my money off the table. So somebody's asking for GU trap. And right, let me quickly look at GU. Now, here's the problem I have with this GU. Here's the problem I have with GU. One second. Uh, one second. So let me explain gold. Uh, sorry, GU. Now, the reason why I had a problem with this GU here, let me tell you the reason why I had a problem with this GU. The problem I had with GU, the reason why I had a problem with GU. The reason why I had a problem with GU was because of this. Was well, because of this here. That's the reason why I had that problem with GU. So, was because, so let me extend this to the far right so that everybody sees what I'm talking about. Um, one second.
All right, good. So you see, this is the reason why I was very cautious with GU because of this area here. That's why I didn't take. So when I saw people like, oh, GU, 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 I was like, no, 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 no. I'm not going to play in that water. All right, let me get rid of you. You are useless for me right now. I'm like, nope, I don't want to play in that water. I don't want to play in that space. Now, I'm not saying this trap may not play out, but I don't like the spot it got um, formed. I don't like this area here. I don't like this area one bit. I don't like this area, right? I mean, it could easily go here and come down based off of the rules of traps, all right? Based on the rules of trap, this is very much valid. But because of how I see the market, I'm very cautious. I don't, I don't want to play there, right? The last trap that we had on GU, and I was wondering why nobody saw, was here. Look at this. Guys, I can't make it up. Look at this. Let's start from here. This one here. Let's start from this here. Follow me closely. Let me pull out my fib on this area here. So look at it. The market breaks out. Retest in this candle comes all the way down, hits your target, right? Good. Next thing. The market comes here again. Gives you another trap. Even though ugly, but a trap is a trap. You give a trap here. Yeah? And then guess what? Pull on my fib. Guys, call me whatever you want to call me, but I'm trapped in. Look at the market came here, picked you up, and went all the way to take profit one. At this point, you know what the drill is. Move your stops to break even, take some money off the table, and wait and hope for the move to play out. See this? 29 pips. That was that. And then the next thing the market did was this, uh, what's it called? The next thing the market did was happen to give us this trap here. This one here. This one, because this one is larger than this one. So that's what the market gave us, give us this trap. So, well, let's see. It could play out though. I think it could play out. I think it could play out for itself, but I want to be very careful. I want us to be very careful. I don't want us, I don't want us to play in waters that could hurt us. All right. So um I think our GJ is moving. I think our GJ is moving. So I think our GJ is moving. So let's just let's just hang on to GJ for now, right? And then we'll just wait for what's it called? Wait for this baby to come pick us. Wait for you are Sorry, do we have any questions if I get off? Tapping is almost off out of this place. Any questions? All right, since we don't have any questions, please be on Zoom tonight. I'll be on Zoom tonight also to talk about a few more things. Be on Zoom tonight. Bring all your questions if you don't have any. Bring your friends, bring your enemies, bring bring everybody on Zoom. Bring the President of America on Zoom. Bring the, the Prime Minister of Britain on Zoom. Bring the President of Nigeria on Zoom. I want to teach them how to trade Forex. I want to teach everybody how to trade Forex. I don't want you guys to go out there to meet people or that's going to scam you off your money. No way. Come, let me show you. It's there. It's, I, I, I can do this for free over and over and over and over again. But if you want more, obviously, you're going to pay for value. All right? So, but for now, let's keep it at that. I'll talk to you guys later since we don't have any questions. And um, have a good day. Peace.